Hi everybody, it's Nalani. How's everyone doing today? I'm doing really good. Back with another Dollar Tree haul for you. Did you see my thumbnail? Did you see this? It's a phone flask. I thought this was really interesting. At the Dollar Tree, now they're selling phone flasks. It is, it's made to look like a fake phone. You don't put this on your phone or anything like that. But yeah, I thought that was kind of funny. So I had to pick it up. I'll never use it. We're not drinkers here in this house. I will never use this, but I thought it was hysterically funny and thought I would show you all. You know, if you have somebody that's turning 21 or a bachelorette party or a bachelor party, these might be fun little gifts. You could um, personalize each one and I just thought they were pretty cool. So yeah, let's see what it says about the phone flask. It says, stash your liquids. Let's see if it says how much it holds. It says, do not carry liquid for longer than three days. It says 3.5 ounce flask by the company Drink Mate. So yeah, it can be a flask. Hey, check out the Dollar Tree. This is this haul is a real mishmash of stuff. I needed a nail file and I absolutely love these. I pick them up quite frequently. I'm not sure if I ever showed one in one of my hauls or not, but I buy these a lot. They're the Sassy and Chic brand and you get, I believe it's eight sides on here, seven. This is seven sides and it has all the different levels of grit on these. I really like them. I use them all the time, especially doing artificial nails and you need to you need to buff your nails before you put them on and you need to like touch up your you know the artificial nail so i buy these all the time absolutely love them hubby loves them you know sassy and chic pick it up um, i bought some flower bulbs this is the first time i've bought their seeds many 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 times absolutely love them it's the first time i ever bought bulbs and i just thought these were so pretty and i know i am going to completely botch the name on here is it ranunculus ranunculus you get five bulbs and it says the the name of the bulb must be oh no i'm sorry they're grown in israel it's aviv mix I'm not quite sure what that means i guess it is the flower itself plant now for summer blooms you get five little bulbs in there That's, i don't know if you're gonna see them very well but i just think they're beautiful and I want to try planting the bulbs. Have you guys planted any of the flower bulbs and what did you think? I, the seeds seem to work well for us, the vegetable seeds, the flower seeds. So I'm going to try these and maybe I'll give you an update once I get them planted and see how they work out for me. But I, just, I thought they were beautiful. I don't have any flowers that look like that and I just, I think they're really pretty. I picked these up and these are actually for, I got two packs, but I only brought one up. I got one for each of my daughters. I love these. I use them between, I think I mentioned in one of my last things, my skillets and pots and pans. I got rid of all my nonstick and I switched to cast iron, stainless steel and ceramic. And ceramic pots and pans are very similar to, <clears throat> and skillets very similar to, similar to the nonstick and they will chip up, scratch. So I bought these to put in between and they work well. They're a thicker felt type fabric. They are very, very flexible. I mean, it's just a fabric, but they come in three different sizes, the small, the medium, and the large. I've had my pack, I couldn't even tell you, probably a year, and they're still in perfect condition. And I thought, I'm gonna buy these for the girls and see if they could use them for anything. If not, I'll take them back. I love them, they work great. They would also work well if you're moving or even if you have special dishes that you you know put away for the season and you want something to protect them these would look work really really well in between your nice you know china or whatever it may be so yeah if you see these give them a try i really really like them and a three pack i thought that was a pretty good deal the rest of the stuff is food i saw the bumblebee albacore tuna absolutely love albacore tuna i picked up two cans we eat tuna quite regularly in this house. I can actually just open the lid, drain it, 
put a little bit of salt and pepper on it and eat it straight from the can. You guys probably think that's really weird, but I absolutely love it just like that. Hubby loves making tuna to the salad. We make um, tuna casserole probably once a month or so. I saw this and saw that it was the Bumblebee brand, name brand, and albacore. I couldn't pass it up. I bought two cans, and if I go back and they have more, I think I might pick up a few more cans just to add to my, my stash. You can't beat that. I honestly have no idea what this costs in the grocery store, but it has to be, you know, comparable in price. So I picked up two of those. We saw this again and picked it up. It's the Gosner Milks. We picked up two of these with the whole milk. This time we said, saw the 1% milk. So we picked up one of each just to add to our, our little stash downstairs. Great to have on hand, great to have just in case you run out of milk, <clears throat> instead of going to the grocery store, you have one. This tastes, it is, it is real milk. There's nothing weird about it, it's real milk. I don't know, like I said in one of my last videos that I hauled it, I don't know what magic they use to make it shelf stable, but it is very, very good. We actually drank one, it's delicious. So why not give it a try? And let me see here, how much do you get is one quart? It's one quart, all natural dairy, real, it has the real symbol, premium Gossner Foods milk, naturally produced, no artificial hormones, all natural dairy product, gluten free. And one thing, like I said in my last video, check this. You don't wanna turn it too far. If it, if it goes really far, you don't want that one. It's open, somebody had twisted it. If it just goes a little bit, it's perfect. And I'll check this one too. And this I'm sure is the same. This is one quart, the same information. I probably should have. These are good till December 11th of 21 and February 1st of 22. Nice shelf life on those. But Hubby actually opened one here not too long ago that I had on the shelf. I was down to just about nothing and milk in the fridge. Didn't feel like going to the store, so he opened one up. Drank it. It's, you know, we both did. We used it for a couple of days. It was absolutely delicious. Um, another thing, I wanted some jelly beans. These are for me. I'm, I mean, I'll have them out for everybody to, to nibble on, but I wanted just the traditional jelly bean flavors. I bought the Starburst and I bought Jelly Bellies. I wanted just traditional jelly beans. So I picked these up. They are by the Crystal Coastal Bay, I'm sorry, Naturally Fat-Free Coastal Bay Confections Company. They are assorted nat or assorted artificial flavored, and it's a nine ounce bag, nice size bag of these. And I actually tried to find the bag that had the least amount of black jelly beans. That's not a big fan of the black jelly beans. They don't, they don't get eaten in this house. Are you guys black jelly bean fans? My grandmother absolutely loved black jelly beans. Me, not so much. So yeah, jelly beans. The next thing I got was a um, four pack snack pack puddings, but I saw these were sugar free. They're five calories per serving. You get two strawberry, two orange. And it also says down here that they are keto friendly. They're keto friendly. I like to have a snack like this. When I'm having a, a sweet urge, I'll grab one of these instead. You know me, I love my sweets. I love my candies. I love my cookies, but some Sundays, so I just, you know, I do keep it in check. So yeah, that, I thought that was a pretty good deal. They also had the, um, just regular, not sugar-free, but I picked up the sugar-free to have on hand. So yeah, it's Snack Pack, another, another name brand product. You can't beat that. And then I picked up these. Let's see if I can hold all three. You guys have probably seen these a thousand times, but with the kids coming down, my, my grown-up kids, coming down to visit more so now in the, the nicer weather. We don't have to worry about snowstorms and all of that. I drink sugar-free coffee creamers. They do not like the sugar-free. So I pick these up. Are they a good value? No. You can get the whole thing of this at the grocery store, you know, for a few dollars more, but it won't, I won't drink it. Hubby will not drink the French vanilla at all. The hazelnut he may drink, he does like this, but when they're here, just nice little bottles. They're eight ounce bottles. It's great. You know, they finish it off. There's no waste. And yeah, so like I said, this is the French vanilla. 
And this is Coffee Mate, name brand. Hazelnut Coffee Mate. And this is the Italian Sweet Cream Coffee Mate. Now, have, grab a couple of these, have them on your shelf. You have visitors come over. Excellent. Let me see if there are expiration dates on these. The sweet Italian sweet cream is the 16th of July. It must be 21. And the hazelnut is the 29th of April of 21. So this needs to be used up pretty quick. And the French vanilla is the 11th of June of 21. So these two aren't so bad. And we have till June and July, but the hazelnut, I'm definitely gonna have to finish off here, here pretty fast, which they will when they come to visit soon. So yeah, I picked that up, have it on hand. I think that's about it for this haul. I hope you guys are having a great day. Spring's here, guys. My daffodils are in full bloom. They look beautiful this year. I think I have 17 flowers on one little bunch, you know, of the bulbs. It, they're just doing great this year and I don't really understand why. Didn't do anything different to them, but they look beautiful. I'm gonna go and actually pick them whenever I'm done here and bring them into the house and bring some springtime in. So anyway, I hope you guys are having a great day and I really appreciate you. I'm gonna say it every time, I appreciate you. I thank you so, so much. If you're watching and you haven't subscribed, I would love it if you did. I'd love to have you as part of our, our YouTube family. We. You know, we, we have a good time here, I think. I think you guys enjoy my videos, and I'm very, very appreciative. But yeah, you guys have a great day, and I want to talk to you again here real soon. Peace.